Hey guys, my name is Magan and welcome to Clarice. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, it looks like it's how you pronounce it, so that's how I'm going to pronounce it. Clarice. Yeah, so I found this game on Game Jolt. Uh, it's developed by a team uh, called Not Human Games. It's about 40% of the way through development, they say, and um, it's been greenlit on Steam. So I'm quite excited to actually get into this. It's a like a 2D point and click game, apparently. So let's go. And it looked damn cool in the in the uh, trailer that I watched as well. So I'm very excited to play this. <laughs> Should be good. <laughs> I like the old school, um, like dial up modem effect. Initializing automatic power systems. Loading memory systems, recalculating values for memory priorities, adding special resources to prime all data. Setting the host's name to Clarice. Done. Configure network interface is done. Setting configuration. <laughs> this is cool. Love the art style. Good morning, Clarice. As punctual as always. I was waiting for you. I see that it was a good idea to program you with that automatic ignition system. As artificial intelligence, you could be on for unlimited time, but the energy on this facility isn't infinite, and I also guess you deserve a break. <laughs> oh Clarice, today is an important day. We are about to finish all the work we have done during the last months. There has been a lot of sleepless nights, so much stress. Cough, cough. <laughs> you see? This fatigue has been affecting me for days. <laughs> I don't know why I'm making him laugh like that. So. As I was saying, today we're about to conclude a stage that I'm sure will lead us to a world full of hope. This will bring justice, peace and equality for everyone. I know that Clarice, my beloved wife, would be proud of us. Oh. Yes, I'm proud of you too, Mr. Cat. Ha ha ha. So, if my estimations are correct, today we should fix the last details of the behavior of the four main devices. Cool. <laughs> Sorry. I would like you to understand the welfare that we are about to bring to the world. The importance of this project in the history of mankind. No more wars. No more hunger. No more injustice. Nevermore. We are going to change the system. What do you think, Mr. Cat? Should we start? Meow. Oh, oh, I missed that. That's the spirit. Cough, cough. Oh, man, I'm starting to feel a little sick. Clarice, please, could you make a fast scan of my vital signs? And, uh, ooh, scanner mode. Oh, okay, nice. So I just... Oh, where's my mouse gone? There you go. I just hover down the bottom. Uh, and I can choose stuff here. Scan files. Nice configuration. Brightness. Let's make it a little, little brighter. There we go. I think that looks good. Now let's go to scanner mode then. Oh, this is cool. Alright, let's scan this dude. What's your name? Body temperature 37.8 degrees. Pulse rate 115 beats. That's quite high. That can't be good. Now, do I just click here again? Breathing frequency, 27 breaths. Blood pressure, 140 over 90. Diagnosis, high levels of fatigue, stress, restlessness, possible viral activity. Medical procedure, repurpose. Oh, sorry, uh, re repose and proceed to a medical check as soon as possible. Should I be doing a voice for Clarice? Let me see. Repose and medical check. Come on, don't be so hypochondriac, Clarice. I really appreciate your motherly instinct. <laughs> but I have no time for that. It's only a low fever and a little lack of sleep. I can't waste time. <coughs> Tomorrow we can rest. So let's keep the hard work. Alright, so I'm an AI, basically. Chris, could you check my personal computer and tell me if there's something important in the mail or news? 
Uh, where is your computers? So let's just... I just want to play about for a minute. Oh, I can't go back into scanner mode. Oh. So the only thing I can check on is this. Let's have a look. It's really nice. It, everything looks really, like, clean. Uh, mail. Dr. Alice Brooke. Roy Batty. <laughs> Kyle Reese. Spike Spiegel. Right, let's look at Dr. Alice Brooke. Hi, Matt. So. How's it going for the saviour of the world? Haha. <laughs> Sorry, still it's funny to me that nickname the press has given you. At least it's better than my Dr. Frankenstein. Have you read the news today? What about the rumours saying that your work is almost done? Is that true? Check the news, buddy. I can't wait to know what you've done. If you were out there and you could see the expectation you've created, contact me whenever you can. Can I re just reply? Leave it, Clarice. I think I'm still able to manage my personal relationship. Uh, let's check. Okay. Those mails checked and answered. Don't waste time with that. Oh, okay. So that means I've checked it. So I can't check any of these. So let's have a look. I want to look at the project files first. Ooh. What is this? Exploded plan of something? Tech arm prototype. Ooh, it's a prototype. Form. Okay, cool. So there's nothing else in there. Let's have a look at the news. World today. Intern leaks in... Is that meant to be show? No. Investors ensure that the mysterious project led by Dr. Matt Simons is about to conclude. Thomas Anderson, Washington. 2nd of September 2019. Reliable sources ensure that Dr. Matt Simon, Simmons... Simons? Simmons? Simons. Is in the final stage to complete his project after achieve... After achieve that a lot of investors and some governments patronise his in, initiative... Dr. Matt Simons reached a deal with, oh, maybe it's 5HW, five, five maybe it's a different company or something, I don't, interesting. Investors to channel all the investments and help him manage the funds. Okay, investors have developed a totally new lab facilities where Dr. Matt Simons could finish his last steps of the project. The project is a totally top secret. All the investors and government have no idea about what Dr. Uh, Simons is working on, but considering his great trajectory, traje trajectory, <laughs> I can't speak tonight, uh, that includes the greatest awards in the field of science and his commitment with human rights and nature, nobody doubts that we can hope for something that could change the world. Dr. Simons never have issued extended information about a project that everybody is waiting to know. Only a code name. Project Renaissance. Hope we can offer more specific information in the next days. So the translations can be a bit iffy, so it might be a little bit difficult to read at times. So I do apologise for that in advance. So let me see. A mail from Alice? Okay, I will answer her tomorrow. And one of those sensationalist rumours that pretend to become a new... <laughs> pretend to become a new what? What does that mean? I'm going to carry on However, at this time, they seem to be right. I guess someone into the... Show investors is more rich today. Human greed. Okay, so, while I make some arrangements, Clarice, please. Could you take a look here and make a fast scan of the main device? Yes, I got to scan something. Oh, I almost forgot. I disabled the security system so you can enter, it, enter and check the devices. Okay, so we go to scanner mode. Anything else I can scan first? No, just this device. Whoa, what is this? Display of their main device. Each system has two operating controls. One is system security and the other is activation control. Check. The first device is a mechanic arm of high assembly system. The second is a sophisticated Rotate system, the only one in the world that can be programmed with multiple speeds. The third is a high precision laser beam to make accurate solders. Already, Clarice? Okay, what do you think, Mr. Cat? Are we ready? Meow. <laughs> okay, let's keep up the good work. Clarice, do me a favour. 
could you set up the mechanic arm and the high precision laser beam? I want to check that there are no problems with these devices. I think I can do that. So I want to set up the arm and laser beam. Okay, security system disabled, set up, activation control. Ooh, what do I do? Do I click on these? Ah, uh, assemble. Okay, so I need to put some of these bits in here. What do I need? Let's just guess. Um, assemble. Wrong. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna go back. Why is it being potent? Whoa, what the hell do I do here? Uh, rotate? Hmm. Ooh, cool. Interesting. Okay, so, what do... <laughs> I don't know what to do. So I've got to get the laser beams over here. Yeah? All right, all right. Well, that can go two ways. That doesn't really help me much. Well, that doesn't help me either. Can I move? Can I? <gasps> oh, I can move things up and down. Okay, great. That can go there. Can that? Oh, that can move left and right. Okay, great. So this, I'm going to move down to here. That I can move there. This. Hmm, where does that one go? Oh, maybe. I think that one's... That can move back and forth. I don't think I even need that one, do I? Yeah, I'm gonna need that one. Yeah, okay, that can go there, that can go there. That can go there. That can only move up and down. I can't move left and right. Okay, so. Right, let's move, let's move all these. Maybe. Oh, okay. Ooh, this is this is difficult. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna figure this out. You come back to me in a minute once I've done this. Oh, there you go. Done. Oh, okay. That's probably not how you were meant to do it, but it worked, so I'm, I'm happy. <laughs> so that's the laser beam working. Can I scan it? Oh, shit, I don't know what you said. What's happening to me? Oh, no. Are you kidding me? Once again, that problem with the energy system. Clarice, can you fix it? I don't know, can I? Oh, energy system panel control. What do I do? How do I do this? I'm so confused. Wait. Oh, there you go. I just had to get it to a specific point. All right. Well, this is cool. I like all these little puzzles. Thanks. I hope we don't have to deal with that more times today. Could you continue with the work? Yes, I can. So, uh, the laser beam is set up. That's done. Activation control. Now, what do I do in here? Is it just a case of plonk and guess? 
I guess. Let's just see. So I wonder if one of them will turn like green or something if it's in the right place. Otherwise, I could be here for ages. Right, what I'm gonna do is just. Oh, I want to see if any of these will turn like green if I get them in the right spot. Because there's no indication of what the hell goes where. As far as I've been able to tell. Am I missing something? Am I missing some clues somewhere? Uh, right, um, let's come out of it. I'm gonna read the mail first. Jack Blow. Dear Matt, our last conversation didn't end so well. I want to apologise, I was blinded by the jealousy. Since we were students, you've always been one step ahead of me. Your career and merits are unquestionable. What I'm trying to say is that I don't think all the horrible things that I told you. Sorry. Please let me know if you need something. SJ Blow. Ooh, how do I want to reply? I'm going to be polite. I'm going to be a nice, a nice person. Clarice, could you answer that mail for me? Please be gentle. Polite. <laughs> Hi, Jack. There's no need for apologies. Uh, we are scientists, but first we are humans. And as humans, we commit errors. I'm about to finish here, so what if we meet when I leave this crazy place and go for some beers? It's good to hear from you. M. Simon. I I might skip on doing the voices for now. <laughs> um, because I'm not very good at voices. Um. Oh, maybe this is gonna help me. There we go. So we have the that battery-looking thing first, and then that thing, and then that thing. Okay. So this is what the project files for. Before there was clues. Okay, so that, that, that. Let's see if I can remember. My memory is terrible. And these things all look the same, pretty much. Uh, that went there. Or was it that one? It was this one, wasn't it? I'm going to check again. <laughs> I'm sorry. See, it's hard to tell which one that is. So the big at the bottom, small at the top, and then the table-looking thing was a little thing on it. That's one big on the top. Where's that table looking thing? And then was it this one? Big on the bottom. What am I doing? Big on the bottom. Sorry. It can't be that. Maybe it's this? Nope. This one. It's got to be this one. Oh, okay. There's very similar looking things no i don't think it's that one there we go well done me <laughs> oh so i can start looking at other stuff now as well what's this i have no information about this okay can i scan the cat i want to scan the cat oh good work therese well done Cheers, buddy. Cheers, Dr. Matt. You know, I think you're right. I'm feeling really bad. I can't work properly this way, and it could be dangerous. Not at this point. Tomorrow will be a, will be a better day. I need some rest. You can shut down when you want. Clarice, see you tomorrow. Ooh, your little face scanner. Ooh, fancy. Okay, so do I want to... I... Maybe I don't want to go to sleep yet. I don't want to shut down. I want to explore. The general security system has been activated. This action is not allowed. Oh. Dr. Matt Simons. Human being. Biped. Organic life form. They're also known under the generic name men. Although that term is ambiguous and is also used to refer to males. And in particular, adult males. 
Human beings possess mental capacities that allow them to invent, learn and use complex linguistic structures. They're a complex unit, unity between body and mind. He is my creator. Oh. Right, I've got to take care of Dr. Matt. As long as he's building something that's nice and not going to basically destroy the world. Right, the central part of the experiment, composed for three different devices. Each device has a unique function in the task of assembly the full prototype of the research. Uh, ooh. Operate with caution. Okay. Uh, I guess I've got to shut down then. Exit system. Yep. Nothing else I can do. Ooh, hello. 2134. 8 a.m. Oh, energy. Power problems. What's, hap what's happened? No, Dr. Matt, don't. Don't be dead. That's really cool well um i guess that's it for clarice um that's really cool i'm i'm actually very much looking forward to uh that coming out hopefully they get um development finished soon because that's really interesting story i want to know what they'll build building um i want to know what happened to dr matt he looked like he was like dead on the um on his table on his computer which i hope's not the case but yeah, really interesting. I'll leave a link down in the description below if you guys want to play that yourself. Um, and hopefully when the full game comes out, I can do a, a full playthrough of it or something like that. Um, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed that, uh, remember to hit the subscribe button, uh, the like button, you know, all the little all the little buttons that you can press. And um, again, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the uh, next video, hopefully. So cheers. Bye. <laughs>